We search lights we can see in the dark. We rockets pointed up at the stars. What about us? What about all the times you said you had the answer? Delta, this control. What about love? What about trust? Uh, who are you? Who are um, you? Hi, my name's Jordan Anthony Raboni. I'm 14 years old and 14. I'm from Perth, WA. Whoa! I always do music whenever I can. Kind of go to school, get in, get out and sing. <laughs> I try to go busking as much as I can, muck around on the piano, maybe write a new song. When I'm doing that, I'm kind of in my element, really feeling the music. Um, and yeah, that's what I love to do. I'm really lucky to have parents that, you know, share the same passion as me. My dad was actually on The Voice in season four. Jordan was tiny. Like I think I was 10, I was 10. You were 10? Yeah. My stomach was turning, I felt sick. I'll give you all That was his chance. And you give me all That was his chance. I, I'm now, I guess, I'm going to live vicariously through my son. That's my, <laughs> that's what I'm going to do now. And yes, he's young and he's only 14, but I tell you, I believe that you will have a career in music. If he turns a chair, there will be no one happier than me. <laughs> time out, time out, time out. You're 14 years old? Yeah, I'm 14. Oh my You're ridiculous. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, <laughs> it means oh. that in a good way. <laughs> Thank you so much. I cannot believe you're 14 years yeah. old. Okay. <laughs> and you sing like that. Welcome to the family and welcome to Team Delta. Yay, it I feels awesome. Play. Thank you. <laughs> uh, who taught you how to sing like that? Um, I've, I haven't really gotten a lot of formal training, um, but, you know, my dad was actually on The Voice in season four. So, you know, I get guided by my parents, and, yeah, it's amazing to have musical parents. Wow. Amazing. Well, this is the, this is the season of massive, massive voices. It's wow. going to be... It's going to be so interesting. Yes. Yeah. This year, the heat is turned all the way up. <laughs> <laughs> My darling. <laughs> the song I've chosen for you is called Scared to be Lonely. Oh, my God. You know? Such a good song. Yeah. Is it just our bodies? Are we both losing our minds? It's a song that's, you know, about relationships which I obviously can't really relate to based on my age. There's always a story. We can find other areas. Well, you know, I used to um, get bullied quite badly, like, all through primary school, so I guess, you know, a way to relate to this song is, you know, thinking about that and when I felt so isolated from everyone and I felt, you know, not, not needed, you know, that I didn't belong. Lots of people who are watching have had those feelings too. Yeah. 
Jordan is so lovely and beautiful and his heart is like outside of his chest. It's so open. Is the only reason you're holding me tonight cause we're scared to be lonely. This is his first run he's already <laughs> Well, that's ridiculous. <laughs> you're done. <laughs> It was great at the very start Hands on each other Couldn't stand to be far apart oh. Closer the better Now we're picking fights Slamming doors Magnifying all our flaws And I wonder why Wonder what for Why we keep coming back for more Magical is it just our body? Are we both losing our mind? Is the only reason you're holding me tonight Cause we're scared to be lonely Do we need somebody Just to feel like we're alright? Is the only reason you're holding me tonight Cause we're scared Okay, so the person I'm taking through is Jordan. Jordan, you are through on Team Delta. The first battle on Team Delta is Sheldon, the All-Star, and Jordan. Hi. You've got one of the most dramatic performers in Sheldon and probably the most understated but filled with heart performer in Jordan. Jordan, he can sing. Sheldon is such an amazing singer and such an amazing storyteller as well. Can you tell I'm nervous versing him or what? Sheldon, how are you feeling? Um, I don't know how I feel about what was said the other day. I would say, Sheldon, you were probably the, the most flat out of all those folks. There was moments where ah, it was just a little flat. I definitely really? disagree with that. I think there was bits where I really, I was going, come on, get to the note. Yeah. I don't know if I was flat or not, but I should have just taken that as constructive criticism rather than an attack. I really want to show Delta that I'm so ready to take this on. The song I've chosen is Praying by Kesha. Oh. oh. I love this song. Oh, me too. Yeah, me I'm too. really happy with it. Oh I can God. really connect to this as well. Yeah. I used to um, get bullied quite badly, like, all through primary school, and I felt, you know, not, not needed, that I didn't belong. What do you think about? We were kind of, you know, all those kids that I've moved on from, telling them, you know, and you were wrong now, the best is yet to come. Yes. Quite a few lyrics that I really connect to. Bullying is really going to be the story that I'm going to be trying to convey to the audience. Bullies are projecting their own problems onto you. Bullies are projecting what they're insecure about onto you. Yeah. <sighs> Sorry, I just... <laughs> I wish I'd have been told that when I was, <laughs> when I was your age as well. I'm sorry. It's, <laughs> it's OK, babe. <sighs> it's kind of just like the song to say, like, go out and do it and show it and live it and Well, you almost had me fooled. I never really sing songs that push me. I don't sing songs that make me feel emotional or make me feel like I have no control. It just, it really makes me quite nervous. I hope you find your peace falling on your knees. Pray. Sheldon and Jordan, the fact that they can stand up there and say these words from a place of experience, that I'm excited for. Well, you almost had me fooled. You told me that I was nothing without you. Oh. And you said that I was done. To come. You brought the flames and you put me through hell. I had to learn how to fight for myself. And we 
both know all the truths I could tell I'll just say this is I wish you farewell I hope you're somewhere like to continue to nurture and protect Jordan. Congratulations, Jordan. You are going through to the finals. Hi. Welcome. Good to see you. Jordan is a real contender. He is a 14-year-old that sings better than anybody a million times his age and he's ready to work. The song I've chosen for you is one of my favourite songs and I think so many people's favourite song out there and that's from The Greatest Showman, This Is Me. Oh, yes. <laughs> I love like that movie? song. Uh, oh, amazing. I think you could really nail this song. I think it could be a really incredible performance. Mm -hmm. I'm not a stranger to the dark. I want Jordan to just open up and feel the confidence and I want him to really own who he is as an artist. You know, you, you've talked about that with bullies or anybody that you've like sort of in your past, this is kind of that moment where you get rid of all that. Mm -hmm. You know, we spoke about it in the battles and the knockouts and then in this moment you're like, you know, like that doesn't even mean anything anymore. Feel, this is me, this is where I belong, this is what I should be doing, I was born to do this. Yeah. You know, there have been people in my life who, who have tried to change me and tried to put me down, but this song, I'll definitely be telling those people that I am who I am and you won't change me. I'm not a stranger to the dark Hide away, they say we don't want your broken parts I've learned to be ashamed of all my scars Run away, they say No one would love you as you are But I won't let them break me down to dust I know that there's a place for us For we're glorious When the sharpest words want to cut me down I'm gonna send a flood, gonna drown them out I am brave, I am bruised, I am who I'm meant to be This is me Look y'all, cause here I come And I'm marching on to the beat I drum I'm not scared to be seen I make no apologies This is me Yeah. Hey. 
Okay. <laughs> this next person I'm taking through. Um, <laughs> under an, an immense amount of pressure in the sense that they are able to just be here and take everything on board that we speak about with professionalism and be able to just deliver with such pure joy, and that's Jordan. Jordan! Our youngest artist on the show goes through to sing again. I've got a little surprise for you from somebody who has sung your song you're singing this week many a times. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Hey, Jordan, congrats on making it this far. That's crazy. Delta has asked me to do her little favor and reveal to you your song this week. Are you ready? Yep. Somebody to Love by Queen. Oh, wow. Well. Let me give you a couple tips about singing a Queen song. Freddie Mercury was loud and over the top and dramatic. So whatever you do, don't be shy. Good luck, Jordan. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Adam. <laughs> Last week we said, this is me. And this week we're just gonna like. Somebody to Love is one of the biggest songs in history. And it's definitely a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I've just got to go out there and kill it. Can Falsetto. I just need to support. Falsetto is one of my weaknesses and something that I've been working on for the last couple of months. But you've got to find the right velocity, push and pull. Yep. It's easier to go like, do, hey, you know. Do, can support, 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 it's okay. I'm asking a lot of you right now. This is a huge song. You can do it though. This song demands that he uses all the different areas of his voice. He is that talented that I'm gonna have to push him. I want him to go out there and sing the roof off the stage. achieved so far is already incredible. How are you feeling about your achievements so far? Really, really proud of it. You know, I've gotten this far and I want to keep fighting to try and make it to the end. 
right now I could be sitting at a desk doing some schoolwork, but I'm heading into the semi-finals of The Voice. It's crazy to think about. This next performance would take us down to the top four. So we're gonna go in focus. I know you're gonna kill it. Yeah. This is your time. The song I've given Jordan is Listen by Beyonce. It's a massive song. These lyrics are really relatable for me. When I began in this process, there were there were people that, you know, said, no, you gotta, you know, stay at school. But this is my learning, you know, listen to me. This is what I'm meant to be doing. My time's now. Listen to the song here in my heart. It's risky to give Jordan such a huge song, but this is one of those songs that can either send you home or send you to the grand finale. The song is so big that I don't want it to feel too big too early. Right. So we really got to be able to pace ourselves so that we then, by the end of it, it just goes lift off. You got to go out there and just show them like, you deserve that place in the grand finale. You deserve to be the winner of The Voice. Yeah. Go out there and go, this is why. Listen to the song here in my heart A melody I start but can't complete Listen to the sound from deep within It's only beginning to find Oh, the time has come for my dreams to be heard. They will not be pushed aside or turned into your own, all cause you won't listen. from Team Delta. Excited to have Jordan in the grand finale. Yeah, I'm good. I'm a, I'm pretty proud coach right now. It all goes so fast, so I want to be able to slow time down a little bit today and just take in the moment. Did you imagine this moment was going to happen after we met at the blinds? Honestly, no. I, you know, I just went into it kind of thinking that turning a chair would be amazing, and to get this far, you know, I never, I never would have imagined it. So it's just so surreal. Jordan is pure light. He is joy. He is love. With such an incredible voice, the best voice of this season at 14. This is the beginning of your journey in music. Yeah. And we need that beginning to be with you signing a record deal. So let's go get you a contract so you yeah. can start making albums for everyone. Yeah. Deal? Deal. Let's do it. Yay! The song I've chosen for Jordan is Walk Me Home by Pink. 
We started our journey with him singing a pink song and now we're ending it with a pink song. Walk me home in the dead of night. Delta really wants this song to be a big celebration of everything that I've achieved throughout The Voice and I'm really going to make it a celebration. I'm going to have so much fun out there and just give it everything that I've got. Going on outside. If that's not a winning performance, I don't know what is. Just do that. Yep. Just do that. Just cut sick. That's my advice this week. I want you to feel the freedom to just do as many trills and frills as you would like. Oof, I never um, thought I'd hear you say that. <laughs> <laughs> never. Hey, let's not get too carried yeah, away. Yeah, yeah, all right. <laughs> let's go out there and kick some butt. Oh. There's something in the way you roll your eyes Takes me back to a better time When I saw everything is good But now you're the only thing that's good Trying to stand up on my own two feet This conversation ain't coming easily And darling, I know it's getting late so what do you say we leave this place? Walk me home in the dead of night I can't be alone with all that's on my mind So say you'll stay with me tonight Cause there is so much wrong Going on outside There's something in the way I want to cry Makes me think we'll make it out alive So come on and show me how we're good I think that we could do some good It all started the blinds, this awkward 14 year old kid got up and sang a song. And I only had one place left in Team Delta and when I heard him singing, he made my heart smile. Yo! And I grabbed everybody and said, come over and be on the chair and let's go. This is who I'm turning around for. I was really confused because I had no idea that I was the last one. I guess I was that would like, have been strange. What are you doing? Like, <laughs> And here we are in the grand are. final. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I've got a pretty intense question for you. Alright, I'm ready, right. Jordan. Who is your favourite artist in the grand finale on your team? <gasps> you cannot ask me that. <laughs> Go on. Whose t-shirt am I wearing, Jordan? Whose t-shirt am I wearing? That would be me. Oh, you're cheeky. Have I lived up to your expectations as a coach? Um, no. Uh, <laughs> I'm kidding, 100%. Yay! You've been just the most amazing mentor. Well, that's ridiculous. And, you know, the most amazing friend. Use that. Lots of people who are watching have had those feelings too. Yeah. And, you know, to have you there every step of the way, I've just been so grateful for that. And, yeah, you're the best. Love you. Love me too. Love my Jordan. <laughs> So, because we're in the grand finale together, we yeah. get to sing a duet. Oh, this is definitely something that, like, I've been looking forward to. We're singing You Say by Lauren Daigle. Yes, I love that song. It's going to be special. I'm so excited.
Every single lie that tells me I will never measure up. I will now announce the first artist who did not receive enough votes and will be leaving the competition right now. It's Jordan. Our 14-year-old superstar. Darling, you're with me, always around me. Only love, only love, darling. 